TWRA stressing the importance of being bear wise after removing a plastic pet feeder from a bear cub's head this week. Now, back in August, a resident spotted a bear and four cubs on her porch with one having a container stuck on its head. Yeah, TWRA black bear support biologist Janelle Muser responded and promptly began a trapping effort. However, the trap was unsuccessful due to the stuck container. Another was this past Tuesday where she was able to dart that same bear in order to help it out. I was able to dart that bear. And that is not something that we typically do or try to do because there's a lot of factors in that and it can be dangerous and stressful for the animal. But given that this bear had had this jug on its head for so long, we knew we really needed to get it off of there. And so I was able to dart that bear and he came out of the tree and then we could take the jug off of its head. Muser also said that the jug on the bear's head came from an automatic pet feeder. Mm, TWRA says garbage, bird seed, pet food are the main attractants to bears, so make sure to secure your trash cans. Uh, don't leave out any animal or human food, especially as bears try to bulk up for the winter. And coming up at 5 o'clock, we'll hear more on how to practice being bear-wise.